Hello and welcome to the YouTube channel MechAware. This video gives you a detailed analysis and information of the things used in Pulwama Revenge, the Surgical Strike 2. These seven valuable things made the mission successful. At first identify the names. These are Mirage 2000 Fighter Jet GBU-12 Bomb Matra Missile Lightning Pod Netra Airborne Illusion 78 Aircraft Heron Drone The first one is Mirage 2000 fighter jet. The Mirage 2000 uses a single shaft engine that is light and simple as compared to other fighter jet engines and is called Snigma M53. The majority of the Mirage 2000 is powered by the Snigma M53 P2 engine. The Mirage is ideally designed to seat a single fighter pilot, but can be made into a twin-seat jet depending on the armed forces requirements. It has a length of 14.36 meter and a wingspan of 9.13 meter. The plane weighs 7,500 kilograms and has a total takeoff weight of 17,000 kilograms. The Mirage 2000 has a maximum speed of Mach 2.2 that is 2,336 kmph and can travel 1,550 kilometers with drop tanks. The flight height is capped at 59,000 feet that is 17 kilometers. The Mirage 2000 has a fly-by-wire flight control system and has a sextant BE-130 HUD, which displays data related to flight control, navigation, target engagement, and weapon firing. In terms of the armament, the Mirage 2000 can carry laser-guided bombs, air-to-air -air and air-to-surface missiles and has a Thompson CSFRDY, a radar Doppler multi-target radar on board. The second one is GBU-12 bomb. The GBU-12 Paveway 2 is an American aerial laser-guided bomb, based on the MK-82 500-pound general-purpose bomb, but with the addition of a nose-mounted laser seeker and fins for guidance. Its specifications are Mass is of 230 kg that is 510 pounds. Length is of 3.27 m that is 10.7 feet. Diameter is of 273 mm that is 10.7 inch and an effective firing range is of 14.8 km that is 9.2 miles. Paveway 2 laser guided bombs use what is known as bang bang guidance. This means the bomb's fins deflect fully, rather than proportionally when it is attempting to guide to the laser spot. For example, if it sees the laser spot and determines that it should make a change it deflects its fins until it has overcorrected and then it deflects back the opposite direction, creating a sinusoidal type of flight path. This type of guidance may be less efficient at times, however is more cost effective and allows the use of simpler electronics in the guidance system. The third one is Matra Missile Close Combat. The R550 Magic Backronym for Missile Auto Guide Interception ET Combat is a short-range air-to-air missile designed in 1968 by French company Matra to compete with the American AIM-9 Sidewinder, and it was wisely made backwards compatible with the Sidewinder launch hardware. It has a mass of 89 kg, length 2.72 m, diameter 157 mm, Warhia 13 kg fragmentation, detonation mechanism is IR, operational range is 0.3 to 15 km, flight altitude is up to 11 km. Guidance system used is infrared homing and the launch platform that is, it can be used with Dassault Rifle, Dassault Mirage 2000, F-16, Sea Harrier, Super Attendard, Mirage F-1, Mirage 5, Mirage 3. The fourth one is Lightning Pod. Lightning Pod is an integrated targeting pod that mounts externally to the aircraft. The targeting pod contains a high-resolution, forward-looking infrared, FLIR, sensor that displays an infrared image of the target to the aircrow. It has a wide field of view search capability. The pod also contains a CCD camera used to obtain target imagery in the visible portion of the electromagnetic spectrum. An on-gimbal inertial navigation sensor establishes line of sight and automatic bore sighting capability. The pod is equipped with a laser designator for precise delivery of laser-guided munitions. 
A laser rangefinder provides information for various avionics systems, for example, navigation updates, weapon deliveries, and target updates. The targeting pod includes an automatic target tracker to provide fully automatic stabilized target tracking at altitudes, airspeeds, and slant ranges consistent with tactical weapon delivery maneuvers. These features simplify the functions of target detection and recognition, and permit attack of targets with precision-guided weapons on a single pass. The fifth one is Netra Airborne. Netra, the DRDO Airborne Early Warning and Control System is a project of India's Defence Research and Development Organisation to develop an airborne early warning and control system for the Indian Air Force. The system mainly comprises of a primary radar and secondary surveillance radar. The SSR provides electronic support measures ESM and communication support measures. It identifies and classifies the threats based on the emissions from them, and also serves as a friend or foe identification system. The sixth one is Ilyushin 78 aircraft. The Ilyushin 278M is a Soviet four-engined aerial refueling tanker based on the IL-76 strategic airlifter. The IL-78 tanker was developed and designed in the Ilyushin aviation complex in Russia. The main reason behind its development was an expansion of the transferable fuel load of an earlier version of tanker, the IL-76. Now let's come to the specifications. It has stored capacity of max 100,000 kg payload that is T6 military jet fuel, length of 46.59 meters that is 152 feet 10 inch, wingspan of 50.5 meters that is 165 feet 8 inch, hay of 14.76 meters that is 48 feet 5 inch, wing area is of 300 square or 3,200 square feet, empty weight is 72,000 kg that is 158,733 pounds and max takeoff weight is 210,000 kg or 462,971 pounds. The seventh one is Heron Drone. The IAI Heron or MACATS-1 is a medium-altitude long-endurance unmanned aerial vehicle, UAV, developed by the Malat Division of Israel Aerospace Industries. It is capable of medium-altitude long-endurance operations of up to 52 hours duration at up to 10.5 km that is 35,000 feet at the Heron navigates using an internal GPS navigation device, and either a pre-programmed flight profile. It is manually overrided from a ground control station, or a combination of both. It can autonomously return to base and land in case of lost communication with the ground station. The system has fully automatic launch and recovery or ALR and all-weather capabilities. The Heron can carry an array of sensors, including thermographic camera, infrared, and visible light airborne ground surveillance, intelligence systems, and various radar systems. Let's come to its specifications. It has a length of 8.5 meters or 27 feet 10 in, it can take off weight of 1,150 kg max. Its maximum speed is 207 km per hour, its range is 350 km, it can serve a ceiling from 10,000 meters or 32,800 feet, rate of climb is of 150 m slash min that is 492 feet slash min, wing loading is of 89 kg, endurance time is 52 hours, payload is 250 kg or 550 pounds.